when I got to the end of my A-levels, the only thing that I still enjoyed doing and could see myself doing something in was product design and graphic design. The natural thing was to go and find something in design. I saw that Loughborough had a good course, and then when I actually came to interview, I was like, yeah, this is where I'd prefer it to be. I really enjoyed the group tutorials in the first semester because you can see where everybody else is at and everybody's projects and get ideas and feed into other people's ideas and you can like use those tutorials as a kind of group uh, ideation sort of thing. That's really helpful, I think. My final year design practice project is a gaming assistant for the visually impaired to help them play video games to a level closer to that of a sighted person. It's a device that takes 2D visual information from a video game and translates that into 3D tactile information that a visually impaired person can interact with and, and get a feeling for what's happening in the video game. I think more technical advice comes from tutors, so mechanics, electronics, stuff that maybe I'm not as good at, but little things like, you know, what do you think the aesthetic of this should be, should I put this chamfer here, or um, like testing interactions with products, that sort of thing, that's a lot easier to do when you're around other students. I did Erasmus, so I went to the Netherlands and studied at Delft University for six months. And then I carried on and did uh, another six months of working in Delft. You get a different culture experience, as well as a different university, uh, and seeing how they do things differently in terms of design. And then also, I got some of the work experience, but I also got some of the study as well. I'd like to maybe go and do a bit of design consultancy work which is just to get a taste of that, really getting freedom with projects and not being kind of shuttled into a small corner and having to do the same thing over and over for a, a long time, doing projects that are constantly different and, and, and new.